What's up live fans? This is Scott O'Gallagher and I'm going to show you the three tiers of our dribbling system in NBA Live 14. Level one of our dribbling system consists of basic flicks and holds on the right analog stick, allowing you to perform quick crossovers and continuous dribbles to set up your defender. Level two of our dribble system is all about chaining these moves together. In this example, you can see Kyrie working everything off of his hesitation. This is a great way to create space against your defender without having to use the left stick. Level 3 consists of holding a modifier and flicking in one of six directions on the right stick. Each player has six signature moves you can go to. You can branch out of these moves as soon as the ball is in the player's hands. Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Hotpot King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. What I want you guys to do is leave me your thoughts inside the comment section about this little dribbling system trailer. Yes, I'm going to break it down, but I want to see your guys' thoughts as well. Hopefully, you know, we can forward a few things to EA. Um, also, another big thing I'm going to need you guys to do, go on Twitter. Go to at EA Sports NBA and tell them to follow iPod King Carter because I got some things to say to them in the DM. But you know, we'll leave that for another day. Now, to break this joint down, they say that they have tiers in their dribbling system, right? Now, the first tier, I'm just going to have to put it like this. Flicking a stick, that's cool. You know, we're used to that already with 2K14 current gen. So, I don't have a problem with that. But the second tier, I kind of have a problem with. Now, even though this player can work on a different set of moves within his hesitation, I believe that it's a little bit too much. I seen the guy move, like you said, without the left stick and was able to get from the three point line to the foul line fairly easy. So I'm, I'm not sure if I like that idea of, you know, being able to combine a bunch of different moves and you're able to get to a certain spot on the court without even actually moving. But that's just that's just my little thoughts. Now, the third tier I like. Now, the reason for this is, you know, we don't have a modifier for dribbling on 2K for current gen, but for them to have six set signature moves for every player, may they probably be a point guard or a small forward, shooting guard, center power for whatever. Hopefully the power forwards can't do what the point guards do. But what I will say is I like the idea that everybody will feel like they're dif different from everyone else you know if you set up a package on a bunch of different players in 2k they all dribble the same they all look the same and you know it kind of gets boring after a while so i'm liking the idea that ea has brought to bounce tech and the dribbling system to actually have every player have their own signature sets now uh one last thing before i get up out of here this is next gen footage um it, it says in game footage right here so you know also leave your thoughts about that in the comment section as well but this is ikc signing out peace year this is siri thank you for watching and be sure to like this video for more videos from this particular mode click more videos if you want to see more content from ikc click subscribe oh and don't forget to follow ikc on twitter and to like his facebook page this is siri signing out peace